Yo, motorcycle sing. Have you ever walked up to your motorbike and saw your chain hanging quite low and thought, nah, it's alright. Alright isn't going to be suffice. You need to check that chain every 500 miles and I'm going to show you how to do that today. Alright guys, so chain slack. It's one of the key maintenance needed. So it's pretty straightforward, but also very important. So why does it matter? Too loose could cause the chain to fall off the sprocket, which will end up with you on the ground or just an irritating noise. And if the chain is too tight, that could cause wearing of the chain and sprocket and can prevent a rear suspension action. How much chain slack should you have on your motorbike well one way to check is in the manual um, you'll find that there or you can have a look on your swing arm the manual will also tell you whether to check this on a side stand or a paddock stand and where to check this from so measuring the slack you want to do this from the center of the swing arm using a tape measure push the chain down measure from the center link then push it back up and measure it again from the chain link. Work out the difference and then that's your chain slack. So to adjust it the first thing you're going to do is crack the axle nut loose. There's one on both sides of the swing arm. Don't take it off just make sure it's loose enough to allow movement in the swing arm when we make the adjustment. So this chain adjuster has a lock nut which you just need to crack free. Make sure the wheel is straight while you tighten, hence why I'm using a paddock stand. Next, you're gonna turn the adjuster a quarter turn at a time on each side. So recheck the chain tension. You may find it can take some trial and error to get the correct one. Once you've got it, turn the wheel, tighten down your axle nut, tighten down the lock nuts, recheck the slack one more time, and now you can clean the chain and lube up if you need to, and that's all it is takes around 10 minutes it's a basic procedure and now you don't have an excuse not to do it if you've got any questions or suggestions drop them down below in the comment section till next time ride safe